Team Error will now begin its presentation. Our team consists of two members, one of whom is Keijo Hayashi, who won first place in the Influence Award, Educational Value at RoboCup Asia Pacific 2021, IG Japan. He also took second place at the RoboCup Junior Japan Open 2022. The other is Akihiro Yamashita, who took second place at RoboCup Junior Japan 2021 and first place in Super Team at the RoboCup Asia Pacific Tenshi Invitational Tournament 2021. He also took second place at RoboCup Asia Pacific 2021 IT Japan and second place at RoboCup Junior Japan Open 2022. We participated in RCAP Cosplay Rescue Under 19. Our task was to collect as many objects on the floor as possible and go to the deposit area. The method we used to do this was to create a function called go to position, which efficiently moves the robot by measuring the angle between the coordinates it is at and the coordinates it wants to go to. As a result of using it, we were able to get a more stable score. In conclusion, to move the robot efficiently, we need to make sure that the robot goes to the place we predetermined. One thing our team worked on was how to avoid entering the trap area. We made a robot move backwards when its color sensor detects a trap line around the trap area. If the left color sensor detected a trap line, the robot would move back diagonally to the left to avoid the trap area. If the right color sensor detected a trap line, we made the robot move back diagonally to the right to avoid the trap area. This is a simulating a robot. In this competition, the robots collect red, cyan, and black objects scattered on the floor and carry them to the orange deposit area and compete for points. Now, the robot stops to take the objects. three types of objects to the deposit area. Only one super object will appear in the world. We try to collect all three types of objects as much as possible because we get more points for taking it. We try to collect objects efficiently by determining the coordinates we want to go to and the direction from which we are heading in order to move the robot as we want it to move. In the program, we decide on the coordinates we want to go to and move the robot in order depending on the map. In this way, the team that scores more points within the time limit wins. In Cospace Rescue, we can simulate what the robot is doing now and how it will get to its destination. We thought that the go-to position and extra we ran in this competition could be applied to real-life rescue robots. Thank you.